All right, so a body weight squat is kind of where it all begins in terms of leg exercises for that whole lower half of your body. We got quadriceps in front, hamstrings, we got glutes and a bunch of tiny little muscles holding it all together. A body weight squat, we're gonna keep our feet completely flat. A squat actually starts and ends with your hips, not with your legs. So the first thing people do is they push their knees forward. That is wrong. What you wanna do is push your hips backwards, squat down, all the way up. Notice her feet completely flat. We're not pulling the toes up. We're also not elevating off the heels onto the toes. Flat feet, push your knees out and get low. Everybody has a different body, different length of limbs, different hip joints. It may not look like this. You may have to squat wider, you may have to squat more narrow, but you wanna get a full range of motion. And if you feel comfortable getting to 20 reps, then you can play with the stance or you can add some weight. But if you can't do this, we're gonna focus first on that. A modification, if you can't get as low as Jesse's going, would be to put a bench or a seat or a box or something and squat onto that. You wanna get at least 90 degrees, so you want your butt in line with your knees to be considered a full squat. If you can get lower, great. If not, that is a full squat, 90 degrees. Use whatever you have to to feel stable, but master the body weight squat before you move on. I can't stress that enough. There's no point in adding 50 pounds, 100 pounds, squatting, 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 if you can't squat properly. Start there. 